Welcome back to Katie and RJ Makeup. I have a guest today. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Um, my name is Crystal. Um, she has a channel which will be linked <laughs> underneath her beautiful face. Yes. So she is my upstairs neighbor's girlfriend. And I'm I don't even know. moving in. <gasps> you are? <laughs> yeah. Temporarily, yes. Maybe. Hopefully. We hope so. Because that would yeah. be freaking amazing. Um, like, how did we um, start talking even? Well, I was just in the house, yeah, and I think yeah. you came upstairs. I think Alvin brought Lincoln food. Oh, yeah. And you came up, and you were like, hey. <laughs> and I was like, this is Jenna. <laughs> I was like, awesome. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, they probably said something. She likes makeup, because they always say no, that. No, what happened with that is you were down here. Oh, that's right, because you needed help with your makeup or, like, your hair. You needed yeah, help with hair. your hair for the wedding. That's right, and I was like, oh, I'm going downstairs, and Lincoln was super confused because no one knew that I turned our basement singular room into my beauty room yet. And I was like, yeah, come check it out, and then we saw my palettes, and you were like, oh my gosh, and then you like messaged me on Facebook and said that I could use your palettes, and I'm the kind of person that if someone's like, hey, I like makeup, I'm like, you should be on my YouTube channel. And here we are today. Before we begin this video, we are going to eat these delicious Zinger Hostess cakes, which she may or may not like. Supposedly they're a lot like Twinkies, and I don't like Twinkies. So. Nope. We'll see what happens. Be interesting. In today's video, we are trying out a variety of different products. I will probably just hold them up, because you will be talking and I'll be talking, and it's just going to be... It's like a get ready with me or an entertainment video. I don't know. The garbage is okay. <laughs> I love these things. It doesn't even smell like raspberry. Uh, I'm scared. No? Mm mm. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, not for me. <laughs> I don't like it. Okay. I mean, it's not the worst thing I've ever had. I don't know. Oh, cool. So I've already primed my lids. I have two. Um, now you're gonna awkwardly watch me do my eyes before my face. <laughs> yeah, it, I think it's weird to do your eyes before your face, but she thinks it's weird to do your face before your eyes. I do. I don't know, I just feel like when I do like my under eye makeup and then fallout happens and it's on my under eyes, it just makes me really angry and I feel like it sets me back 3,000 steps instead of moving me forward. I don't know, I just kind of like half trying to wipe it off. I'm like, whatever, it's probably gonna all fall <laughs> off anyway. <laughs> Can't do it. Let's see. So today I am trying out the Tarte Graveyard Girl Swamp Queen. I'm so excited to try this out. I've heard so many great things. Let's see, what else, what is this called? The Nubian by Jubius, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, it's like Jubius Place. I'm super excited, but look at these colors though. Like, look at these. My gosh. Yeah, I bought that because Nikki Tutorials mm -hmm. raved about it, and I was like, I have to have it. Yep, that's usually how I buy most of my palettes. Same. And then I am also trying out the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Platinum Skin Frost. Woohoo! Yeah! Ooh, they're all really nice. So those are kind of the palettes that I'm using, and I will be using this hard candy. Look at this glitter! Wow! It's amazing! And probably a little bit of this Milani, which I might actually purchase, because these are all of the colors I would use. Yeah. And there's like matte colors, which you don't see very often. It looks like a mostly matte palette too, which is like, what? How? Oh, yeah, like the purple, the blue are both matte, the white's matte, the green is kind of shimmery, but like, not bad at all. Since I'm doing my face first, I'm going to prime my face with the Too Faced Hangover Replenishing Face face Primer. That's what it is. I love this stuff. I can't wait till I run out and have to buy a full size one. <laughs> I, let's see, what is the hopes for buying next? Outside of the Jeffree Star, what is it called? Red blood? Blood, bro, blood sugar. Blood sugar. I really want to get that. Yeah. Um, 
for some Jeffree Star products, there's just so much of him. I like look at it like, oh, I really want to buy it, but then I'll see something else that I want. And if it's like too much pull from one or the other, I just don't get either. I don't get anything. So that is something that I'm just like, I really, really want this. I'm actually going to buy it. Yeah. It's going to happen. Let's see. I really need to dilute my cleaning solution because there's just so much olive oil, it's making them oily. I'm going to do a green smoky eye today. Oh, this color is gorgeous on my skin. This is, ah, oh, this is that like gross pukey brown that I like. I love that. This color. gross pukey yes, brown that I like. It is so good for just like smoking out smoky eyes. It's perfect for that. It is the perfect like transition shade. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Amazing. So I'm gonna go in with my foundation. I've been using the Wet n Wild Photo Focus foundation and I love it. It's really good. What kind of skin do you have? Mmm. I think it's combination, but more dry. Okay. I think. Oh, that stuff confuses me. I have very dry skin. That's very annoying. And I don't even really have oils, like not even in the summer, which is the confusing part because I feel like I should have some kind of oil yeah. going on. Yeah, I think I'm dry, but I don't know. It's weird because my foundation like comes off my face. So I feel like that's a characteristic of oily skin. So I don't, I don't know what's happening anymore. I just don't question it. Is this like a pink? Oh gosh. I'm just super clumsy today. Okay. Me too. <laughs> Before we started filming, I was like dropping everything everywhere. Oh wow, I was trimming. Mm -hmm. This is not one of those videos where I don't swatch things. It's not happening today. I don't know, I just find makeup more exciting when you don't swatch things, unless you're like in a store trying to buy something. Whereas I swatch everything. Nope. Because I just want to see its beauty. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. My thing, when I go to a store, I just want to make sure something feels right on my skin. Yeah. And then when I get home, I'm like, I don't need to figure out what these colors are. They'll show up on my lids somehow. <laughs> Who is your favorite YouTube beauty guru outside of me? Obviously. <laughs> Yes, you're definitely <laughs> the one. Um, I don't know, it changes because I love Nikki tutorial tutorials. Mm -hmm. I love Manny MUA. Um, I watch Rach Loves a lot. I've never heard of her. What does she do what does she mostly do? Um, she does a lot of drugstore stuff, but also some high end. Um, uh, she's really good. She's really funny too. She's like cute funny. Awesome. <laughs> um, she's less of a savage than like no. Manny MUA <laughs> and Jeffree Star. Yeah. She's more wholesome. She's a mother, so I mean, that be that way. Is always a nice like change. Yeah. Because sometimes I do love the savagery, and other days I'm just like, ugh, I'm tired of hearing you talk crap. Yeah. Do something else. Um, I love Tati. Of Ooh. course. I've never actually, I watched one of her videos, what was it? Um, she was trying out this weird, like, flat iron that had Z's in it, so oh, that, like, yeah. when you scrunched it at the top of your hair, it would make it fluffier. I actually haven't watched that one, but I, I've seen it. It was weird. It was definitely weird. Yeah. Um, I've been watching a lot of Shan XO. Okay. Lately, 
um, because she's been doing decluttering videos, and those are just so satisfying they to me. They really are. I just love when she, like, speeds up the, um, her taking all the stuff out of the drawers and the sound. I love that sound. <laughs> so weird. That's understandable. Yeah, I was just sitting down here before you came down organizing my stuff, and I was just like, ooh, this feels good. Yeah. This needed to happen. Alright. That's blended enough. Now I'm going in with my concealer. Can can't even speak today. <laughs> Using the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Fair Neutral. My foundation was I don't even know. Soft ivory. Cause I'm pale. <laughs> the struggle of pale people. You don't even know. <laughs> Right now, I'm just deepening up my crease with different browns. Who is your least favorite? Or do you follow anyone that you don't really like? Mm, not really. I don't know, sometimes I'll get annoyed with some YouTubers. Mm -hmm. Like, don't get me wrong, I love Jeffree Star, but I haven't been watching his videos a lot lately. I don't know why. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Mm. I'm not a fan of, um, James Charles. I'm back and forth with him. Like, I love his really creative looks, mm -hmm. but other than that. I follow Jacqueline Hill. Oh, I love Jacqueline Hill. Um, but I'm kind of, like, back and forth with her channel sometimes. I don't know, I just have... Trouble staying interested sometimes. Yeah. So I used to not like Laura Lee <gasps> just because of her voice. That's understandable. I used to not be able to handle it, but then I got used to it. I was like, I love her. She's so sweet. Yeah. I really like how important her fans are to her, which, like, everyone yeah. cares about their fans, but I feel like Laura Lee goes the extra mile. Mm-hmm. This darker shade I am taking is now from the Graveyard Girl palette. It is Sippy Sippy, and I really like that name. It's cute. It has these little flicks of gold that I am just digging. And you said you've never watched Graveyard Girl, right? Mm -hmm. no. So all of these things are named after things she says. Oh. So she says Sippy Sippy. Um, Dogman is her boyfriend. <laughs> Cute. I'm so sad those hostess kicks are gone. They're just so good. <laughs> I love trying, like, weird, like, Oreos, especially. <laughs> yeah. I really liked the ones I had for 4th of July that had Pop Rocks in them. Mm -hmm. Those were my favorite. They were so good! Because I love Pop Rocks. Pop Rocks are probably my favorite candy. Mine are definitely watermelon sour patch kids, Ooh. or any kind of gummy bear, especially if it's uh, mango gummy bears. Those are so good. Something that I um, miss about Milwaukee is having uh, Get Happy, which is a store that you can just walk in with a little jar, and you can fill it up with as many gummy bears as you want because they only make you pay per pound, I think, wow. or something like that. It's just weight based and you can actually fit a lot and pay just like ten dollars barely even. See this is what happens. Stuff doesn't want to stick to my nose. Oh no. I think things have the hardest time sticking hmm, probably to my forehead. Yeah, my forehead doesn't really have a problem. It's my nose. Always my nose. Oh, these colors are just blending so nicely together. Maybe I should try a halo eye. I've never done this before. I don't know how I do it. I honestly just do smoky eyes. Mm -hmm. Or smoking neutralize. 
So I'm planning on doing something colorful. Hopefully. I'm oh jeez, I look so pale. Mm-hmm. Okay. In person, I don't look this pale, I promise. <laughs> All right. Could not steer away from color completely. And actually, I feel like this is going to look very much like a Christmassy look because I'm trying Jeffree Star's Poinsettia. Yeah, point. Yeah, poinsettia. And it's just gonna be a fun time. Look, it looks messy. Oh gosh. Oh goodness. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> this trouble. I'm just blending out my smoky eye just a little bit because it was getting kind of messy and it needs some help. Kind of look like a raccoon. I'm gonna be honest, but that's my favorite animal, so it doesn't matter. Just gotta keep smoking. <laughs> Let's see. I think we're done with this. Well, <laughs> I have that song on my playlist. Oh, I love that song. That song makes me giggle. When yeah. um, Lincoln shared that with me, I died. I was like, oh my god, this is the best thing in the world. He's like, you're so behind. I'm like, so what? Leave me alone. This is amazing. Yeah, my family was singing it at Christmas. Yes! And ever since then, ever since Christmas, it's been stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. I'm now going in with the Hermannerisms Envy, which is a green color. We're going to pack this baby on. I want it to be bright. What's your favorite season? Fall. Ugh, I hate fall. Really? Yes, it's too cold or it's too warm and I just don't know how to dress and then I get sick because I dress for cold or I dress for warm. It's just not a great time for me. I don't know. I, it's like sweater weather for me, so. Mm -hmm. That's the thing I do like about fall is the sweater weather. And I love Halloween. I love mm -hmm. going out for pumpkins, like going to get pumpkins and carving pumpkins, and Halloween movies. I love oh, Halloween I love movies. Halloween movies. Like Hocus Pocus, and I don't like scary movies, right? <laughs> but but I love Halloween movies, like Hocus Pocus, Halloween Town. No, Halloween Town is oh, like Halloween Town is such a good movie. It's a good movie for nostalgic reasons, but if you actually like sit and think about it, like. The plot of it isn't that good. Yeah, that's true. It makes me mad. It's just like at the end. Sorry, spoilers here for anybody who hasn't, hasn't seen, seen Halloween it. Town. Which I feel like I you mean, haven't seen it by now. I think you're we're not getting to the generation to. that hasn't. You know, that yeah. it just hasn't. It does not be It doesn't aired exist. Anymore. Yeah. But at the end, where all of them are just holding hands and humming, and that just magically, like, works works. I'm like, that is so cheesy. Mm -hmm. Like, that's that's not how life works. Not how life works, kids. I topped this off with the Super Shock Shadow by Colourpop and Cusp because I needed to brighten it up a little bit. I have so many baby hairs. Then you are blessed. <laughs> baby hairs are the best. I mean... I wouldn't go that far. I love my baby hairs, but I also like, I like to uh, style them so they're like all over my face in curls. Yeah, see that's cute. It's not as cute when they just stick straight up. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, what are you doing? I did not feel like doing my hair today. I was just like, I could do my hair or I could just not do that. Yeah, me too. Alright, I think I look a slightly less dead. Um, this'll help. I'm gonna do my blush now. I'm using the Model Co. blush in shade Peach Bellini. It's my favorite oh, blush. Bellinis are so good, though. Wow, what even are Bellinis? They're, if I remember it, I think they're, like, peach and champagne. Ooh. They're so good. It's, like, not even just, like, for peach juice. It's, like, peach, um... What is it like? Not it's not concentrate. Maybe it is concentrate. It's like not juice, but it's like thicker. Yeah, the juice I know what you mean. It's delicious. So, what's your favorite song that you've covered so far? Um, you probably don't know, but 
my YouTube channel, I sing covers. <laughs> That's it's probably a good piece of information. Um, I'm not sure. Um, I really liked Someone Like You Ooh, by Adele. That was a good one. Um, the only song I have memorized on both guitar and ukulele is I'm Yours by Jason Moran's. Oh, what a good song. So, that one I'm pretty good at because I play it often. Um, I don't know. Yeah, probably those two would have to be my favorite. Um, I did sing in church once. Ooh. Recently, not recently, it was like last August, I think. Um, and obviously, I sang a Christian song. It was Worn by 10th Avenue North, okay. and that went pretty well. I liked that. It was somebody else playing guitar, and then I was singing. It was fun. Very cool. Um, my choir and uh, high school we did this really cool 12 movement that was all in a different like each song was a different language yeah um and it was called calling all dawns and it was absolutely amazing it was so fun um and then another year i mean that was the same year i don't even remember but we did um a mozart a few mozart Ooh. pieces oh my gosh I'm a high soprano, and so, like, there were yeah. a lot of times in, like, both of those where we had to sing super high. Mm -hmm. And, like, a lot of people love roller coasters. I hate roller coasters. Me too. Like, my biggest thrill is from singing super high notes. Yeah. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. When you hit that note, that's, like, hard for you to hit. Mm -hmm. and you just nail it. I love doing that. It's so fun. Yeah. I regret putting that glitter on my face. Like, normally, I don't mind glitter, but goddamn. God damn, God damn. <laughs> yeah. Another one that I really enjoyed that I covered, it's not on my channel. It's on um, a friend of mine's channel. Name's Abigail Jenks. She also has a YouTube channel. Um, but we did a duet cover of. Um, what's it called? It's by Elvis. What is the song called? I Can't Help Falling In Love With You. Mm -hmm. That's the song. Or, yeah, it's, I think that's the name of it. It's, I Can't Help Falling In Love With You. But it's, it's really pretty. And we did a duet. And it was a lot of fun. I love singing with her. That's good. I definitely miss playing piano. I used to be pretty decent at it, and then I just stopped practicing. Yeah, me too. I've been playing piano for 15 years. Oh wow, nice. Yeah, started when I was 6, and I'm 21 now, so I think, yeah, that that's 15 years. Oh, <laughs> oh no. That's okay, we'll work with it. We will. Yeah, I should have should have warned you about that. I mean, you said they were pigmented, but you said the shadows were. So, you know, it just happened. I mean, we we learn our lesson. Oh, does highlight? Let's be. And I like when I can like see things on my face everywhere. Let me know what's there. I'm gonna clean the shadow off for you, cause that was. Yeah, I usually just like blow on it, like. Well, not right here because. It'll get everywhere, but I'll put some of that up the top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I'll use a different brush. Blend it all out. Yeah, I'm really like, um, what's the word? Reserved with contour because mm -hmm. I remember one time I did my makeup and I contoured. Or just bronze. I never actually use contour colors. I just use bronzers. Mm -hmm. um, and my dad came down into my room and he looked at me. He was like, what's that brown line on your face? Mm -hmm. And oh, so yeah. ever since then, I'm just like, just only a little bit of bronzer. Mm -hmm. Make me look not dead. 
Nothing too crazy. That's why I like the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer, because it's very light on my face, which is weird because I'm pale. And I know it works very well for a lot of different skin tones. What's your favorite beauty product? Hmm. I feel like it, it would have to be eyeshadows or eyeliners. Because, like, some eyeliners can work as eyeshadows if they're creamy enough. Yeah. Um, but usually when I'm purchasing products, like, the first thing I look at is eyeshadow. Yeah. How about yours? I mean, I love highlighters. Mm -hmm. I just love that glow. I don't... It just... It gets me. But yes, 10 out of 10 would recommend the Master Chrome <laughs> of Maybelline. I am going to use the Tarte Feisty Blush. It's one of her blushes. And we'll see how it looks on my skin. What do I do next? I usually um, use a setting spray right when I'm done with this part. Oh wow, that finish is weird. Yeah, I don't really use that that much. I don't. It's really strange. I don't oh, know. But it's not red. It's like. Oh, it is nice though. It's so strange. <laughs> it's like, it's frosty, which I'm not used to. Yeah, this one's frosty. All right, here are our faces. Trying out new things. The liquid look for me, I put like glitter on top and then I added like a lip gloss and it started flaking. But I really like the halo eye. I feel like a halo eye is supposed to have like a lighter color in the center. Mine's kind of dark. brighter. Yeah, so I'll have to try this again. But I loved all the products that I tried. How about you? I 
really loved <laughs> all of the products that I tried, especially the Heavy Metals palette. That's gorgeous. Oh, and then to finish off my look, I put the Cella Ivory Lace Highlighter Crayon in my waterline. It's my favorite thing to do. And then uh, my lip is the Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid in the shade Sinful Stone. And I love it. <laughs> So thank you guys for sticking around for the video. I hope you enjoyed us. We were very focused. We didn't talk very much, but uh, I was trying something new, so I, I could not me think. Me too. <laughs> so hopefully you join me for another video. Oh, of course. Love having you on my channel. And subscribe, like, comment. Yeah.